Roseville High School. Joining us live is CJ Addington, the science teacher at Roseville High School, with more on this titan of stench. Good morning to you, sir. I'm so glad you're here because I just assumed it was my 13 year old son's sneakers that were smelling in Roseville. Wow. But apparently it's your plant, right? It's your plant. Well, it certainly could smell like sneakers. This plant is known for its really, really bad odors. Uh, sir, what is this even doing on this uh, high school campus? Why did you bring this corpse flower to Roseville? Well, as it turns out, we're one of the very few greenhouses in the area, or one of the few high schools in the area that has a greenhouse. Uh, and about 20 years ago, we started as a lark trying to grow a titanarum, or this giant corpse flower. Uh, we bloomed one in 2011. We were actually the first high school in the world to do that in 2011. And this is our second one. Uh, and this one is a six foot two tall flower that we expect to open sometime later today. That is amazing. Oh. Six feet tall. So is there a precursor, like, is there, um, I guess, like an advance aroma that, that lets you know <laughs> um, that this is about to open and bloom? That, that's what we're sniffing for. If, if it's going to open today, we're going to start smelling an odor probably around midday or so. And then this afternoon, it'll start to open. Uh, if it does open today, we're going to be staying here until 11 p.m. for the viewing public to come and enjoy and sniff, take a big whiff. <laughs> <laughs> so that was my question. So uh, folks can come by the school when it opens up uh, and smell the plant. Now, you guys are alerting people, right? You get some sort of alert system to, to tell folks? Yes. We, we have a text alert system going. We've got an email blast that we're going to do. We're going to be making some phone calls. So uh, I'm going to be monitoring the plant all day, putting my nose in there every few minutes. And <laughs> as soon as I see that it's opening and flowering, I'm going to be letting people know. I think we need right. to see you test it. Exactly. Uh, how does one put their nose in it to see? Just, you know. Uh-oh. Yeah. I don't know uh -huh. if it's going yet. It's going uh -huh. in. It's going in, people. And? There's a, there's a hint of something in there. <laughs> it's getting a close. It's getting very, very close. A what, is the, what is the point of that weird smell from the plant? Is it protecting itself from something? Um, no, it's actually to attract its pollinators. This plant grows in the deep, dark jungles of Sumatra, and it's pollinated by flies. So rather than making a sweet smell that would attract bees, it makes this rotting flesh smell that attracts flies. Wow. Which is pretty unusual for a giant flower like this. That's true. Yeah. Mr. Addington, I'm also seeing that there are a lot of other places that are talking about their corpse flowers in bloom. So this happens at the same time every single year, or does it depend on when you plant it? Does it change? They, most of the corpse flowers in America bloom in July and August. Okay. It seems to be their cycle. Uh, they bloom in Davis, Berkeley. There's a couple of nice ones at the National Botanical Garden in D.C. Uh, but uh, they do bloom about this time of year. But this is the only one at a public high school. All right. Thanks for joining us. I really appreciate it. Good luck getting that smell out of your clothes. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> we'll see him coming later right. on today. Does he, get a, does he do like they did on the old Partridge Family episode when they all got hit by the skunk? Uh -huh. And they uh -huh. all took the bath and the tomato juice? The tomato juice. Does that same thing work I for this, know. maybe? I don't know. Those things really do smell. You know who I want to be the true test? Because there's one person in this building that smells amazing every single day. Uh -huh. I want that person to go up against the, uh, the corpse flower. Who's that? Court? It's Courtney. Yeah. Oh! I put a little amazing. corpse flower behind my ear. Every single day. It's <laughs> amazing. Just the thought. We're going to see it. Is there a crime scene around here? <laughs> Should we be calling right? CSI? Yeah, like, we probably should send.